Uh, clear my throat. Welcome back to the 2009 Wolfenstein. Hopefully this will be the last session, and uh, let's just do this. We're uh, we're on the Zeppelin. Whole lot of Nazi scum on this here Zeppelin. Um, it's not as I forgot this game's not as bad about ammo and stuff as uh, the newer counterpart the new order is which I'm constantly running out of ammo in that game which uh, we'll return to throw back throw back Whew. hold on now I gotta shoot. shoot hold on now I gotta I can't remember the buttons Okay, it's R2. I forgot all the buttons. Oh, well. Okay. That worked out. I gotta get used to the controls real quick. It's been, uh... Not only has it been a few days since I've last played, but I also played a completely different game the last time I did play. Okay, let's use this one. Ow. Quit moving, dude. Hold up. Yep, I'm dead. Alright, well, we're getting right back into this with a good point. I looked on the IGN, like, little walkthrough, like, guide thing. I didn't look to see what the actual mission is or anything like that. But I looked to see, um, like, how long it was. And, uh, the last mission we did, the airfield was broken down into five parts. And this one was broken into four. So, it leads me to believe that this one is a tad bit shorter. And then, uh, the last one, Chapter 10... It's like the Black Sun or something like that. It was only two parts. So I'm assuming Chapter 10 is probably just one big boss battle. And that's it. That would be my guess and assumption to what it is. Let's go ahead and get rid of that now. Get rid of Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Hip shot. There it is. Oh man. Yep. Reload. There we go. I got him. No problem taken care of. And the updating was, was like, it was like a little load screen in this. It's like, updating helps a lot. You should try it. It really does, because I updated this gun, and this gun is now amazing. I used to not like to use it, but now I'm okay. I guess I can't look around. Oh, oh, we're on another Zeppelin. I thought it was... Okay. I thought we were just, like... I don't know. I don't know what I thought. I didn't think we were on what we're on. I heard they're searching the entire cr oh man. Shoot, well, that didn't work. Worth nothing.
Like, are you serious? Bring it on, punk. I'm hoping I took down Mr. Skellyface. Oh man, it did. That was easy. I'm assuming this level probably also kind of... I, I don't know. It's making me wonder if it's wanting me to take the more stealth route. But there has not been any stealth element to this game at all. Not compared to how New Order is. By any means. Planting dynamite. It's a good idea to plant dynamite while we're like on a while we're on a Led Zeppelin. <laughs> is that a good idea? I don't feel like it is. Oh man. Scorched that dude, didn't I? That's weird. Just kind of spraying. Seeing what that does. Like I said, I feel like there's probably stuff in there, but I guess there's not. I think the point of me blowing stuff up was just to get every to get the elevator down here. I didn't really think Zeppelins were this big. I mean, this is... I don't know. I, I just don't feel like this is the size. I don't feel like they ever were this quite massive. I'm going to get have a nice cool Oh, hey, buddy. Glad you can make it to the party. I take it we don't got to use those, as I was hoping we did, but apparently not. Open this door. Oh, Jesus, dude. I'm really expecting fire, dude. To burst through the door in two seconds. Kind of caught me off guard. Oh, boy. Nope. That's not the gun to switch to. This is. This is not the gun to switch to. I forgot this has a stupid silencer on it. Why does this thing have a silencer? I don't know. Oh yeah, because it was supposed to be for that stealthy mission, and when I, which didn't turn out worth anything either. Why do I start shooting in here? I guess if I was, I guess that's maybe what I was supposed to do. I was uh supposed to f freeze time or something and run up here to one of these bad boys? That'd be my guess. As to what was supposed to happen, but didn't quite, didn't quite do that. Hold on now, I want to take. A Gonna reply to a text message real quick. Okay. Uh, it says I got two little, like, to do thingies.
I... These guys up, man. Nope, you guys stay over there. Just let me get on this real quick. Alright, that was easy enough. Alright, easy enough. Uh oh, I don't like where this is going. General Death Shed. I have much to thank you for, Herr Doctor. Shoot him with the sniper rifle. Without you, we never would have known where to excavate for the portal. My information is always correct. Did I not tell you the American would be at the train station? And where you could trap Caroline Becker? Very true. But I still have my doubts about your latest data on the portal. How can we be certain it will remain active? I assure you, my students properly translated those two manuscripts. The portal will work. <laughs> ah, yes. Your students. Weren't they even vaguely suspicious about your true intentions? That you drag them to Eisenstadt to translate the Thule manuscripts for the Third Reich? No. Blaskowitz kept everyone so focused on his antics. No one had time to think of much else. The Golden Dawn has no idea I work with you. You work for me, Doctor. Not with me. As you wish. But please, let us pass through into the Black Sun Dimension. I wish to see it. And be redeemed. After a lifetime of ridicule. I'm sorry, Doctor. But you're taking a different journey. Oh, we the same. <laughs> Come with me. The weapon will be firing soon. Man. He is to be shot on sight. What are you talking about? The good Nazis are dead, Nazi. Okay, I don't know what the point of that was. Oh man, that's lame. Yeah, that's not the way to go. Go, 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 go. Let's see, I hear some baddies. Forgot how much of an arm these guys got. Did he literally just walk over to that edge on purpose? To fall off of it? I would have to say that's a pretty impressive feat. Okay. Let's mess these guys up. I 
I can't find the skeleton guy. That's who I'm looking for. Where am I getting shot from there? Sand over his dying carcass so I can reheal. <laughs> Once again, I hear the skeleton man. I don't see the skeleton man. There he is. What? What's that? I couldn't hear you. The sound of you choking on your blood. I don't have very much ammo. Oh, what's this? Convenience? That's rare. Especially for a video game of this stature. Something really bad is about to happen. Because uh, they, don't, they don't just give you ammo for nothing. I seriously just clear this room that easily. That's pathetic. There's no way. I did. Oh, that one's missing his head even. I this is really confusing. Is that one way out? I don't understand. I'm supposed to get across. Probably this. I think this is annoying. Look, I found. Man, why can't I hit anything? Thank you. Oh man, I don't know why I can't hit nothing. I'll tell you this though, this is having the uh, one dude dead to help pick these guys off a little bit easier. Oh man, I don't even know where I'm getting shot from. Oh, there's people up there. Well, there for a second I was behind cover. Man. Oh man. Where'd he come from?
All right. For the most part, I think the Nazis are gone. Let me go collect some ammo. Alright, we got this. What now, ninja boy? I don't even know what caused that, in all honesty. Oh, Jesus, girl. Oh, man, I didn't. So where she's even at. Where was my last checkpoint? Hopefully after I flip that switch. Oh, good. Bring it, punk. What the hell is that? Yep. I'm just gonna hide for a bit. I feel like that seems like a pretty good idea. For the time being, anyway. Oh boy, yep. And strike his ass. Oh man, I did nothing. I'm out. Peace, boy. That was the end of the Zeppelin. So this is the last little bit. I made it on board the Zeppelin, and I overheard Dr. Alexandrov talking to Death's Head. Alexandrov was the Is it Death Heads or Death Shed? But he must have worked with Anton Krieg because Krieg claimed to have given information to the Nazis too. Death's Head had Alexandrov executed. Death's Head. Can't say I'll miss him. But now I have to follow Death's Head <laughs> and Hans Gross through the Thule portal <coughs> into the Black Sun. There, I'll have to stop them before they can fire that super weapon and destroy Eisenstadt. All right. Let's do it. The last mission. I'm assuming it's just kind of a boss battle kit <laughs> site. That's my guess. Since there ain't much to this. I don't know, I could be 100% wrong. But I'm just saying, because like, the walkthrough part is only a two-part. where That one was a four-part, you know? Gee, if it doesn't go on, we might not have my hour finale. Uh, all right, that's all they're going to give us. Oh boy, yep. Well, before we head on into here, let me send a text message your way. <laughs> yeah.
Yep, that's right. I'll text right before the big climactic event. I'm assuming I just go right in here. Yep. Agent Blazkowicz, you have an annoying tendency to appear at the worst possible moment, which is why I have taken certain precautions. <laughs> Such raw, unbridled power. It destroyed the soul civilization. But where they failed, we will succeed. I have the technology to control it. And our first demonstration will be on the city of Eisenstadt. After that, I will destroy all that stands in my way. The world will fall on its knees before the Third Reich. A shame you won't get to see the swastika flying proudly over Washington DC. Uh <laughs> kind of halfway there. <laughs> oh boy. Yep. Is there something crazy to this dude? The Gnom's gonna blast him with this dude. My medallion is just as powerful as yours! So now we are equal. You'll never get more. Oh, man. I don't know. That should have killed you, Blaskovitz. That had to really hurt. I'm about to do that again. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Hold on. Let me see here. Oh man, I completely missed that shot. Oh, no. Alright. Is that how? Okay, hold up now. I'm not quite sure what I have to do. Oh man. I was actually doing it. I don't know, I feel like I am. Uh, can this thing shoot through? That's Tesla gun. Who would right mind wants that gun? Oh, that's what I gotta do. Hmm, this actually might work. Shoot me for a second, dude. Yeah, I would. Stab him. Okay. Yep, don't like where this is going. No shields. 
Then I don't need one since I can alter time itself. Where are you hiding, Blaskovitz? It's time to die. I don't know where you're even at, dude. Call me coward, I'm trying to find you. Oh boy, nope. Oh, nice to call people names, dude. Okay, I'm not quite sure where he's at. Where are you? Too bad you're so slow. There you are. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh yeah, I ain't done with you. I'm not running away, I'm waiting for you. Oh boy, there he is. This thing's out of my way. Hold up now. Two of those left. So hit me with cheap shots, dude. I couldn't even see where he's even at. Try to use that shield some, but the shield's lame. No shields. Well, I don't need one since I can hold on time itself. It's time to die. Where are you at, bitch? Where'd he go? He's at, but this is actually kind of intense. Where you at, man? Well, I can't find you. I don't even know where you're even at, dude. I run all over the place. Right, I'm like a little bitch right there. Crushing the life from your butt! Ooh. 
evil. Don't do it, Raskovic. Was this how? Stop, you idiot. Is it I, what I have to do? Give up all my powers? Well, I'm done with you because I'm starting to run out of ammo. Is he dead? About that running out of ammo thing? Yeah, just slide. I've only got two crystals left. Here I come. Nope, that did. Walked right off the edge. <laughs> hey, we gotta do this again. This is ridiculous. The last one will probably be the Veil Crystal, which I don't, I don't know how they're going to... Ow. I want to take some croc shots. Okay, this is confusing. What? die from oh this is starting to press my last nerves I'll tell you that right now really starting to press my last nerves all my weapons are reloaded. Like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Soon we Nazis will rule the entire world. He's up there shooting stuff at me, but it's like I can't... See? What am I dying from? What in the world? This is bullshit. It's starting to get really annoying. I mean, really annoying. Because, no, I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to do. Because I get to a certain point and it's just like, insta death. And it's like, okay. But am I supposed to fight him? Like, what am I supposed to do? Okay, and I get up here. Now what? That's all I could think of was to blow that up. Well, that sure doesn't quite go far enough. Maybe this will. Oh man, that was a bad shot. Yeah, 
I've done a pretty good job so far. I don't need a crystal to destroy you. Why are you hiding? Not hiding, I'm fighting your waves of monkey man. That was a waste. It'd be nice if it'd start shooting. Stop hiding, you cover. Well, that sucks. This gun's awful. Can I just smack him to death? So these guys aren't so much of a threat as they are annoying. Is he actually dead dead now? I think so. Object complete. I hope so. Jesus Christ. Let him be dead dead. Bet you he's not. Nope, he's not. Hold on now. Soon we Nazis will rule the entire world. Is this the best you can do? Oh yeah, I forgot I don't have the slow-mo anymore. Got him down. Kill him. I'm, st I'm killing the crap out of you, dude. Hold on, I got 24 shots at. I'll light him up. End game. That must be it, baby. Take that, Nazi scum. Going back to the Zeppelin? Must be. Well, I beat the game, I'm pretty sure. I call the engineer guys, just like, oh boy, this is not gonna be bad. Yep. I'm waiting for a cutscene like the opening intro. That'd be nice. Oh, don't tell me it's gonna be one of those flying parts where I gotta dodge debris, because that'll take a couple times.
Oh, that's broken. Oh well. Let's not keep that so the U.S. government can see it or something like that. Let's just chuck it into the into the void so some pillager can pick it up. Director, mm, okay. the mission was accomplished. General Zeta is dead and his research has been destroyed. The Thule portal and the Doomsday weapon were smashed along with the Zeppelin, so all access to the Black Sun has been permanently cut off. Unfortunately, the medallion is a burnt hunk of metal and glass, ruined when the portal was shattered. Eisenstadt has been liberated, the Nazis have withdrawn, and the Kreisau Circle has taken control. It's too bad the Golden Dawn vanished. They would have made good allies despite Dr. Alexandrov. As to Death's Head, I'd like to think he died in the crash. But somehow I get the feeling we haven't seen the last of him. Do I smell a BJ sequel? Blaskowitz. There better be something else. If that's the way they're going to end it, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> oh, you've got to be kidding me, right? That's the end. No... Big finale ending cutscene, no crazy. Really? That's the way it's gonna end? I like to think he died. End. What? No. The, the ending was just him jumping away, throwing a medallion, just like, <laughs> walk away. Not even like going back to the US. Good job, PJ. You know, you did a good job. You, you stopped the whole entire Third Reich on your own. <laughs> I heard this is based on a true story. <laughs> I'm kidding. Oh boy, the end game assessment of Wolfenstein, the 2009 uh, game on the PlayStation 3. It's also for 360, I don't know if it's, I doubt it's for the Wii. Nothing cool came out for the Wii besides Mad World. <coughs> but it still was alright. Nah, House of the Dead Overkill was cool, but it also came to the PS3, so I'm not going to count that. Anyway, I don't know what I'm getting. 2009 Wolfenstein. I have to say I really liked it besides the ending. The ending was crap like that's what you're gonna that was it started off it had this big like cool intro that really kind of set the tone of, of this game it's gonna be like all right this is gonna be a pretty cool action game and then it shifts from cool action game to a sci-fi style action horror in a way i wouldn't say very heavy with the horror but there were some horrific things and it was kind of like okay yeah, i didn't really suspect it'd be so suspenseful and then it was like boom into the game and i was like what? Like it literally it didn't feel like the end of the game. And what I mean by that was is it didn't feel like anything got I mean I wouldn't say got accomplished. I mean, you took out the the black sun, but like what I'm like the portal and everything. But what I'm trying to say was is like I don't think I don't feel like uh that should have been the end. I feel like there should have been like one extra cut scene or you know, it feels like something was missing from the end. Uh, and that's my biggest hang up on this whole entire game, in all honesty. Um, and we're just going to talk about a few of the things I didn't like before I get into the things I did like. Because I feel like the, the list is relatively even, but my biggest hang up was the complete ending. Um, because it wasn't like a very satisfying ending. It was kind of like, yup, here it is. Uh, that was it. Um, kind of like, excuse me? That shouldn't. You shouldn't no shouldn't shouldn't there be something else like are you sure that's it are you you positive you're not missing a cutscene or, or nothing that's the end oh, oh okay <laughs> you know um and another thing i didn't like was the going back and forth through the towns i really feel like that was just a cheap way to extend gameplay and it was really kind of the it was the grinding feel is that's what it felt like you really got that rpg grind to it in a way in a bad way um because i really felt like i was just grinding to get to the next mission i just i had to kill a whole squadron of nazis get the mission kill another squadron of nazis go to the mission kill hundreds of nazis come back kill squadron of nazis get the mission you know it was just kind of like bleh, when it came to that um and i didn't really like the whole idea of the black market and you know the, the small RPG elements that was in this game, I really didn't like that well. Um, other than that, I really enjoyed this game. Uh, you can get this game at GameStop for like 
I think like eight bucks I think really super cheap and I would if you're looking for just a fun game you know you got ten bucks you said you know I want to go to GameStop see what the used games they got see what they got under ten bucks this would definitely be on that one of the top of the, my list to pick up because this game was pretty sweet it was really fun uh, for the most part it was it was fun like I said that grind feel to it and the ending really just was really anticlimactic just it was not satisfying it was not a satisfying ending uh, I wanted to shoot death head right in the head and uh, so yeah uh, it's just it was it was a pretty good game I like the the gameplay mechanics I feel like it played pretty well for most parts um, the guns eh, the guns were guns uh, it just seemed like you had your standard, you know, two assault rifles, your sniper rifle, and then you just had some crazy guns. And it would have been nice to have a shotgun, but, you know, I will, uh, I like that, uh, particle cannon. The, the one that, uh, like, disintegrated people, and the other one that tore things apart. Those two guns were awesome. The Tesla gun was awful. I hated that gun so much. Um, but yeah, like the story itself, I mean, there was some parts, you probably watch back in the walkthrough, there was some parts that really had me on the edge of my seat, really zoned into the game. Uh, and for that, it, thank you, game. Uh, it's been a while since I've got that caught up into the game. I mean, yeah, South Park was really fun, uh, but it didn't have me the edge of my seat holding my stomach, you know. South Park was making me laugh and was enjoyable, yes. But it's been a while since I've played a game that's kind of held my stomach and, like, keep me on the edge of my seat. Well binary domain so never mind <laughs> sorry wolfenstein uh i don't know i think it's a pretty good game because i mean like i said i did get really involved into it um but it's just that grind feel it's not the best game i've ever played but i've played far worse and out of all the walkthroughs i've done on my channel this would probably be in my top five i think i've done like i'm think i'm rounding toward 10 now or so i don't know because I've, I've done i would say it's in my top five as of right now <laughs> just to just this new order kicks this one out of the water though i like how a new order uh isn't so much it's more of a realistic i mean it's got some sci-fi elements to it with like the mechs and things like that but it's uh it's not like a supernatural horror kind of thing like this is and uh for that i think it's um it's kind of weird because the opening cutscene to this uh cinematic was really really well done with some very very good uh cgi in it and then the rest of it fizzled out it's like uh the graphics i feel like could hold their own for the 2000 and not i think i'm pretty sure it's just 2009 for the time it came out but for uh an end of the game i don't know for now it's it's not it, you can definitely tell it's dated i'll put it that way it's not a bad looking game but you can tell it's dated um which i guess that's a good thing to say about an older game is you know if it doesn't look that bad and uh this is pressing a half a decade old now man it literally does not feel like it's been that long since it's, cause i remember playing the demo before this game came out wanting to get it when this game came out yeah whatever either way uh this game's a pr pretty fun walkthrough uh hopefully we'll have a new order finished relatively soon and that'll be actually one of the fastest walkthroughs i've done on my channel besides medal of honor warfighter which is literally two sessions that game is so freaking short uh this game was i i don't know what's this this is probably what the 22nd or 23rd video uh so it was I mean, it wasn't too bad i mean it wasn't very lengthy but it definitely wasn't too bad um south park had 40 videos flat at uh which would have been actually 43 if i don't do the hour long which south park was uh Hold on. I'm trying to... I'm doing some math here. I want to see. South Park was... Uh, I don't know. I'm doing this. South Park was 14 and a half hours long. So let's say we're at uh, 23 if you break this down. Let's just round it to 26 videos. Because I'm not sure how many videos we're at, right? If I divide that, blah, blah, blah. Um, I did that wrong. If I, man, I gotta figure out how to do this. This game clocks about seven and a half, eight hours, um, which I feel is about right. Just rounded, you know. Um, but, uh, I think it's a pretty, 
I mean, that's kind of short and sense, but it's enough, to, I think, to to wet your whistle. Um, I'm, any game that the story is less than 10 hours and really doesn't have a very good multiplayer should never be $60. You should never pay $60 for that either. Uh, this was like 8 bucks, and I actually got a new copy because... Uh, it was a whole situation with GameStop about me not my PS Vita. I bought one from them and it was used, and I bought a new one and it was used. Uh, and I took it back and they gave me ten bucks store credit for my troubles of having to drive. And they gave me a new one and a free download code. But I also uh, I picked this up and they gave me a brand new sealed copy of this game. So that's awesome of them to do so. Um, because I'd, I would imagine a sealed brand new copy of this game probably goes for a little bit because of how old it is. Um, I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe it's dirt poor cheap. But either way, it's pretty cool for only like 8 bucks. And this game was pretty fun. About a dollar an hour <laughs> is about what you're paying for. Which uh, isn't that bad. It was pretty uh, enjoyable. I'm glad I got to play it finally after all these years because like I said I wanted to get this game when it came out back in 2009 just never did uh, and so now what five years later I got to play it <laughs> and I, I did I did really I did enjoy this game this game was pretty fun there was a couple nights where I felt like I really wanted to play it um, which is always a good thing but yeah I, I'd say this game was pretty enjoyable and uh, like I said, if you're looking in the mood to kill some Nazis, this is, you know, you don't want to play Nazi zombies, you want to kill actual Nazis, uh, probably get a new order, because that's a lot better. But this is this is pretty cool. Set back in that old, nice World War II time. Um, but yeah, I mean, this, this game was pretty cool. New Order is way, thousand times better than this. Actually, New Order. When I first started playing it, I was kind of like, mm, I don't know what to think about this, but now actually playing into it, a good bit of a way I'd have to say that a new order is actually really awesome and I really like it um, so even though I feel like a new order is probably gonna round the same seven and a half hour eight hour mark which kind of sucks um, I mean it really sucks because like I don't know I wish wish it was going to be long because like they the rumored it was like going to be like 13 14 hours long or some very long campaign but like the rad brad he cuts his videos up about the same line and he got to i think like part 18 was his last part which sucks because i wanted it to be so much longer um so i think i'm about halfway because his uh part 18 was an hour long so i'm thinking about the halfway point uh, is what it seems like and i don't know new order has been pretty cool um <laughs> definitely going to return to that at uh some point this week um shoot i gotta re re uh, fill my phone card um i'll do that right now well right after this video is over the credits the reason why i show the credits is i feel like that's fair um, in all honesty, because for one is it gives me an overview to like uh, talk about the game and you know my thoughts on the game and things like that it gives me a chance to like review it. But um, not only that is is I feel like you know these people they spent time on this game you know and whether if they're proud of it or they put a hard job into it that's totally up in the air. But either way they did spend quite a bit of time into this. Either way, and uh, I think it's just, I feel like it's just fair to run the credits uh, at the end of the game. You know, it'd be the same thing as a movie. So I feel like it's fair, and that's what I'm going to do every time. And plus, like I said, it, it gives me time to talk about the game and things like that. Uh, but now with this out of the way, we'll focus on a new order. Hopefully get that done uh, relatively soon. And then we'll really focus on Ragnarok and uh, Earth Defense Force. Ragnarok, I can already tell you right now, is going to be really long. But, uh, ooh, we got to get something after. Oh, we're getting something after credits. That's another reason why I wait for the end of the credits.
death shed. Death hit. Death's head. Man, that's hard. Huh? I kept wanting to call him death shed. Too bad I don't think there will ever be a sequel to this game. <laughs> I'm just saying. I think uh, this game is done. Well, guys, I just looked. We just clocked right at one hour. So, guys, I do hope you enjoyed this walkthrough. I really enjoyed this walkthrough. It seems like you guys actually were really digging this walkthrough. Uh, I mean, till here recently. It's what it always does. Starts off strong, fizzles out at the end. Whatever. Um, I don't care. <laughs> That's all good with me. Uh, I do hope you guys enjoyed this walkthrough. I, if you guys watched it front to finish, I feel sorry for you to sit through and listen to me. But I, I do hope you enjoyed this walkthrough. I really, really enjoyed walking through this game. Walking through. Playing through this game. Whatever. I enjoyed the story. Guys, if you enjoy these videos, you know my spiel. You can press that like and subscribe button. Share this to your friends. Uh, and I'm going to refill my phone. I hope you guys take it easy. See y'all later.